Toughest road game, I would say, is McDaniel. Well, they're all tough. <laughs> I, I really can't point point any, any school. I know they're all certainly difficult to win any game on the road here in the Centennial Conference. The toughest road game. Um, Hopkins is always the toughest, I think. Um, their gym is pretty small, and they always have a packed gym, so their fans are getting on you from an hour before the game until the very end. So it's always a tough game. Uh, F&M is always pretty tough, too, because it's always crowded. Uh, Johns Hopkins. In all my years, it, the toughest road game has been Franklin and Marshall. Um, we haven't won there in, in a long time, and uh, since I've been there, I'm not sure if that has happened. So I would definitely say Franklin and Marshall from my standpoint. I don't know. Just historically, the, the, the road games that I've played, I mean, Dickinson's always tough because, you know, they have such a large crowd and, you know, like their school loves especially the, the rivalry between us. And um, especially last year, we didn't, we didn't do so well against uh, Dickinson on the road. Um, but I think that's just, you know, another goal for us to set for ourselves because, I mean, no matter where we play, home or away, I think we should, you know, play our game and, you know, play to what we know instead of, you know, the atmosphere that we're playing in. Toughest road game is every game. Everybody in a conference is tough on their home court. Toughest road game, I would say, is probably F&M. Um, when you go up there, they, it seems like they bring their whole town out to cheer against you. So um, it's fun to have a lot of spectators watching, but, you know, when they're really heckling you hard, it can be kind of a tough atmosphere to play in.